I'm Davnet Conway Schaefer, and I'm the Executive Director of the Denison Pequot Sipos Nature Center here in Mystic, and I've been with the Nature Center for almost 20 years. We're standing on the top of Great Hill at the Peace Sanctuary, which is on the Groton side of the Mystic River. And this property is about 30 acres, and it is a parcel of property that the Nature Center does not own, but that we have managed for almost 30 years. It is in a trust called the Akeley Trust, and it is, the intent of the trust is to keep this land open for conservation and for educational purposes. This land has a very long and very interesting history, not just in the history of Mystic, but also in the history of our country. Um, this was indigenous Pequot land, and um, played a very important role in their history. Um, it also has a very important role in the Civil War era, that this was called the Peace Grove, and the Universal Peace Union used to hold very large peace rallies here um, during the Civil War era and after. Also held rallies around abolitionism, and also indigenous rights and suffragette rights. So lots of people would come, 10,000 people at times would come on this hill and listen to speakers um, and try to find ways to connect peaceful, peacefully in their community and in their country. So very, very long history here um, that is really critically important. Now this property is predominantly woodlands. There are also some very interesting habitats here, including the cliffs that we're standing on and some ledges, um, which provide habitat. And why we feel this is so important is because this property flanks the Mystic River on the Groton side, which connects over to some of the properties that we own and manage on the Stonington side, helping to connect a very large greenway right in the heart of Mystic. This property in particular, one of the things that Mary Jove Akeley did when she um, acquired this property in the 20s was make a camp for girls. And there were programs here, that they had tennis courts up here, um, they would ride horses along River Road, and they would go down to the boathouse and do um, kayaking and swimming right from the boathouse. So what a fitting way for us to connect this into the Stonington Community Rowing Center. And this property and the Stonington Community Rowing Center and the site of the Boathouse Park connects a greenway on the Groton side and the Stonington side that people then would have access to trails on both sides of the river. We do lots of different programs up here in particular, including full moon hikes, we do birding programs, we do um, hiking programs, and we would love to be able to work with the Stonington Community Rowing Center and other organizations to do collaborative programs about kayaking, paddling, getting people not just to the river, but out on the river where they can see nature and learn about our community firsthand. Um, there is so much nature to be had here. These two properties protect the Mystic River watershed and the Coogan Farm across the river also protects the Pequot Sipos River watershed. There are a tremendous amount of birds of prey that are up here and in the very soon um, in February we'll start to see bald eagles here on the Mystic River including up here at the Peace Sanctuary. Right now we still have our ospreys here and this is a wonderful opportunity for people to learn more about our community, our natural history and to get people active and out on the water. These pieces alone, these parcels of open space are, are kind of isolated without that connection of the Mystic River Boathouse Park and the Stonington Community Rowing Center helping to get people to them through the river.